All right, here we are. So we are in the 1v1 game. Oh, let me spectate with Capture Age. I'll pull over uh, into that app. Will it let me? It will let me. Okay, uh, I'm going to fast forward to live too. So if you fast forward, it'll just take us as far as we can. So I'm at like a minute right now. Okay. So we... Are, are you, You're still hearing me, right, Mike? Yeah, I just okay. muted myself. All right, just making sure. Okay, uh, so 1v1 here with Bunky versus Fresh on Arabia. So they went random sieves. Fresh ended up with Incas, which I think he had tried a eagle play in one of his previous games, so maybe he might go into that. Could go archers. That would be what I'd do if I were him because he's been practicing archers quite a bit. And then Bunky with Saracens. Um, kind of stinks for him going up against the Mezzo sieve is as Saracens, because Saracens' go-to play is either archers or camels, and why would you build camels against Mesosiv since they don't have cavalry? So, um, I think the Civ advantage goes to Fresh here off the bat, and then also as I look at the map here, looking over at Fresh's side, seems pretty wallable. Like, he's got that big wood line up to the north that he can wall to, and if he notices the one gap at the top, can wall off an entire corner down around his base. But Bunky, uh, not so wallable. A lot of forward gold, you know, nothing really... Berries are safe, and I guess they're gold back there, but wide open along the front half of his base. So, uh, Fresh's golds are a little exposed as well. So, we'll see how this goes here. Um, starting off, I... Guy's doing a good job with the idle TC time. Getting to that six on food. Going to lure a boar. Fresh coming in with one. Ooh, Bunky's had a little uh, multiple sheep down. Uh, goats down. We'll see. Fresh going to pull in and... Ooh! Wait, did he lose a vill? No. That, did that vill survive? Oh, he garrisoned. Whoa, that was close. That build survived with, if I can click her, uh, 4 HP. Dang. Tough for her. Okay. Um, berries are a little rough. If Blunky's able to get some pressure out early, excuse me, it might be um, tough. Oh, I didn't notice this wood line. I was wondering where that was at first. So check over on Bunky's base. He has a nice safe wood line in the back at least. Um, pulled in an Elefanto. A couple weak bills, but no problem here. Um, okay, and looks like Fresh is going to be able going to go into scout here. He's got yeah, he's going to be heading straight into Bunky's base. Should be able to realize it's him here once he sees this elephant here soon. Oh, sees the elephant, got scared, turned around. Um, <laughs> probably wants to find more stuff explore around his own base a little bit more pushing deer those are some really far pushes if he does nope nope no. um found all his stuff bunky on the other hand found his Ooh, ooh, we see some laming oh he delayed the elephant oh he's pro I, i'm sure uh tom is calling james a little son of a bitch right then oh trying to go for some shots on the eagles oh no oh no oh no bill going down eagle going down Elephant's going to run back. He's going to have to lure again. No, got the shot on the elephant. Pulled it in. No, don't lose two. Okay, pull the second one. Shoot the elephant. Pulling the elephant in. Okay. So, the advantage here. So, Tom lost a vill. And Fresh lost the scout. Lost the eagle scout. So, um, let's see what... Bunky, Bunky's about to find it. Oh my god, if he runs right under the TC and loses his scout too. I, I should say Eagle Warrior for fresh. Um, but he's going to find... No, he's not! Oh, I thought he was going to find that wood line. Having an idea of where that wood line is off the bat would be useful. Um, but you do see the five stone. This should be telling. This should let you know. Do I see 19 vil? Is that a... Yeah, that is a housed loom, I believe. Um, Tom should know that he's right here. Um... More vills after this. Uh, idle. 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 Drop it off. Yeah, there we go. Then just clicking up. Okay, 19 vills. Thinking stable, maybe? Maybe some stable. Stable uh, scout rush. Where'd that... Oh! There it goes! Dodge it! D 
touch it. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm going back. I gotta. I gotta see that. I was just wondering where his scout route was, and then it ended up underneath it. All right. So let's see this from Bunky's perspective. So he's coming in. Yeah, I'd be worried away from a wood line as you're going in and you know he's in this area. And Fresh goes for the... How do you dodge that? Oh, my God. 3 HP. Dodge him. Dodge him. All right. And then he made it out. Dang, that caused some uh, some idle time there. Oh, and got a hold of the got a hold of the goats. Oh, is he going to be able to make it out with the goats? No way. The Vils should be able to capture him. Turn him away to the corner. And he's got Vils sitting under the TC. Oh, this is tough for Fresh. Oh, we can pull the other goat in. Oh, a lot going on. Okay. Phil's coming to try to steal the goats back, and we have a goat war. Uh, scout running on. With the scout having no HP, that just. Oh, Phil's going for a shot. No. Oh, man. What's the idle time going here? A little bit more for Tom, but he's up on his way up to Feudal Age. Gonna be quicker, about 30 seconds. Uh, let's see if he goes for scouts. I'm a little surprised with getting on gold already. He might be thinking archers as well. Um, in which case, you know, honestly, I feel like James going eagles might be the play. That's what that's what I'd do if I was in James's position here against Saracens. I wouldn't be so worried about Saracen knights or um, infantry. Um, as much as I would others, but we'll see how this goes. All right, so what is Bunky's play laying down? Oh, didn't get a barracks on the way up. So might have missed that with all the uh, fancy goat harassing. And we have man-at-arms uh, in militia, which I would assume would be upgraded here since we're in feudal uh, for fresh. It'll be a little late on the man-at-arms, but not terribly, honestly. You'd want to come in a little sooner, but... 12 minutes should hit. Typically, like the, I think the best you can get, you can get them in around 10. If you're real on top of it, I'm never able to hit that. But does he, see, so he sees, uh, he sees the TC, yeah, because he was, he was under that. Um, gonna explore around, probably searching for wood lines. Doesn't see the wood lines. That's, that's a little unfortunate because if he, if he knew the wood or this gold here, um, oh. Sorry, clicking the wrong one. Um, coming in and hitting this gold could be big. Oh, but he's going to be on the berries here. Man-at-arms coming in. Let's see this reaction from Bunky. You want to run those away? Run the... Oh, and he's got the... He's got the... He's in the way. Uh, don't let him pass. Oh, will this Phil make it? No, yes, that one's safe. But no, you got a body block. You got to use an extra man-at-arm to block him. Okay, got the... Force the idle. Don't eat the DC, though. Not bad, not bad. There doesn't appear to be a gap in there. Um, and scouts coming out. There is scouts. So yeah, that, that was a forgotten uh, barracks on the way up to try to get the scouts out sooner. But the scouts will be used here. And fresh with a major advantage. The TC has been idle for so long for Bunky. Oh, but these man-at-arms should clean up the scouts quick. And... Had the... And the uh, hill advantage here for a second. Coming in. Uh, gonna want to try to take the scout out first. Ooh, ooh, did he get the hit? Oh, made him delete a house. He's running away. Man, this has caused a lot of havoc on Bunky. This has turned into an eight vil lead. Solely from solely from the pressure. And the problem here is uh Fresh might not be feeling like he did much with that, but it did cause the damage. Um didn't get kills, but uh, led to a lot of idle time with that good pressure. Uh, with that good pressure from him. And Fresh going for these walls. Wasn't able to scout, having lost that scout so early. Doesn't see the easy opportunity here for like a, a stone. I'd put one stone wall there and then wall off here. And you're safe around that whole backside. Uh, did tower up on that hill. I guess, yeah, overlooks the gold. A little preemptive, but... Uh, not terrible. Oh, Bunky's able to get a vil kill here. And Fresh might be feeling a little, uh, a little behind, even though he is still ahead. Um, oh, need some, need some more shots on the scouts. Get those spearmen over there, and you're going to want to get these spearmen protecting your gold. Quick. These scouts are low. Be fighting back with these vils. Just fight back. Oh, 
man, just quick hits on those scouts. You could have taken one out just with Ville punches. Um, and now idle TC time packing for both, packing, racking up for both. This is that point where you're pressuring like Bunky is and you forget to run your TC. So if you're not getting a Ville, every, Ville kill every 20 seconds, you're actually going down. Oh, man. Oh, good. Going to find this extra wood line. Uh, these scouts might do some damage. These scouts might be able to... Fighting back with one. Oh, man. I'll get some more kills. And I think Fresh is going to be seriously feeling like he's behind here. But that is not the case. Oh, and here come the spears. Cleaning that up. And now I'm interested in what Fresh's plan is here. Because I've only seen spears uh, coming out. I wouldn't invest too much in this. That's five, six now. Yeah, I would stop investing in that. Does have a great farming eco. What do we have? 17 farms down. Dang. Versus 9 here for Bunky. Uh, has the little food lead. The, a lot of floating wood and gold here. A market. Uh, going blacksmith. Market might be able to get to Castle H here quicker, but um, we'll see how it goes. Interesting. What, getting gold mining. Trying to collect some more gold. Might be able to use that market. Saracen market abuse. I want to get that market up quick as the Saracens. I forgot about the Saracens. Bonus there. Um, patrolling out in front of the base. Not a terrible idea. Blacksmith. Market. And by the time those are done, I bet you Fresh will be able to make it. Oh, double bit axe just coming in. Uh, horse collar got double bit axe already for Bunky. That's going to help him quite a bit. Uh, make up for the Ville difference here. Um, yeah, 45 to 29 pop difference. Uh, it's a good position here for Fresh. Uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. A uh, bunch on gold. So I'm wondering what Fresh's plan is here. So infantry armor. Do we see the eagle play? You want a lot on gold for eagles. Um, you have a safe one. Buying food. All right. Sell, sell some sell some wood and go or you're you're real close there we go collecting castle and so eagles will he think eagles i without seeing an archery range up at all at this point i would hope that that's fresh's thought uh, bunky on the other hand nice so oh, man he's going to be able to wall in here could stay safe from uh eagle raids if he's able to wall up well from it um and then, unfortunately, I'm not sure what what the play is here for Bunky. All right, I'm going to fast forward because we had gone back a little bit. Uh, yeah, we're back up to live again. And Castle Age came in for Bunky, and it's going to be pretty similar. 15 seconds apart. Uh, infantry, armor, and attack. Okay, maybe he's thinking infantry. Maybe he'll just go uh, militia line. I'm not sure. Do Saracens have champions? I'm going to look this up while we're going and see what we have. Look back on Fresh's side. He's fully walling. There is a gap back here, though. Uh, so if he walls around, let's see if he knows it right. Let's see if he notices it. I'm going to leave this right here as I'm looking up the Saracen tech tree. Uh, see what their infantry line looks like. Uh, Saracens. Um, they do have champion. We have champion and all the blacksmith upgrades so yeah they have fully upgraded militia line ah but scale barding so knights so bunky's going knights long run uh long run not as great with saracens um they do get uh, they don't get Paladin. They don't even get Cavalier. So this is only a Castle Age play. Uh, the full random coming to bite Bunky here a little bit. Um, we'll see. Fresh does see that hole there. So I would assume into Wallet. Another TC. So two, C two CCs for Fresh. Uh, sticking on one for Bunky. And now if, if he's able to get this pressure here. Oh, he goes two TCs as well. Okay, so we're going to see some Vill production here. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Quick uh, drink of some Moscow Mule. All right, and I'm back. Um, oh, and the Eagles are getting produced here. Okay, got his upgrades, and now this is going to be a battle then of night, like night numbers versus a mass of Eagle warriors. Um, 
attack upgrade coming in. I, I usually prefer the def prioritize the defense before attack, but um, not terrible. Also, it comes in handy if you switch over to infantry that you've got that already. Wheelbarrow coming in. No lumberjack, uh, no lumber camp or mill upgrades for Castle Age yet for Bunky. Um, but the knights will be formidable. And here come the eagles running around. And I think this is fully walled. I do not see gaps here. There might be a gap there. That looks like it's on a hill. So I'm going to assume no gap. Um, but that's me assuming because it's not me playing. <laughs> that's always a tough one to tell. Uh, the rest is good. Going to need more on gold, though, to keep up knight production. Uh, where are these knights? Oh, the knights moved forward. They moved forward. Okay, so we have eagles in the back here. Are they able to get in? Oh, is there a gap? Oh, there's a gap. There's a gap. Oh, and he's... Oh, take that veil. Take that veil fresh. Oh, the gap. Oh, I wonder if... Bunky's able to tell it. And then the knights pick off some reinforcements. Not terrible there. Uh, these vills, there is an opening. Oh, there's five vills here. And Bunky is going to be in some tough position here with the eagle push. Man, fresh still a minute and 20 seconds idle time. Done a really good job keeping his production going. Um, all right. Hit that hard. Got a few more. What do we have the eco KD? Still. Wow, yeah, it's still only three kills for Fresh on the Eco. But we do have another chance here. Picked off one more, able to evade. And the Knights are in here at the same time. So one, two. Oh, the Knights are going to be able to clean this up way more. Okay, so that ended up being even better. The Eagles are standing still because Fresh is scared. And there's a hole. There's a hole here. Oh, will he be able to avoid the TC? Uh, get one more kill, but and now avoid the spearmen. That's going to be the real issue, not the TCs, because these spearmen are still hanging around. This might be a good point to add in some... Oh, man, I don't even know. With so many eagles around, you don't even want to add... Oh, no! He came back to try to fight this, and these e these are going to get cleaned up. Oh, I think you... Man, that's tough to, tough to tell what you prioritize here. Trying to clean up your base or keeping that alive. And Fresh going for another TC. He is booming, booming, booming. Way ahead in Vil count here. This production is going to be hard to beat. Yeah, and this is the... Like, Knights are better than Eagles, but when there's... so, It's so much easier to get the numbers of Eagles that Fresh is at. Uh, that's going to be tough. Oh, going to fight the repair. I think that's a losing battle. You need a third one. Oh, there's so many. Oh, there's so many eagles. Oh, and they're going to break in. And suddenly off gold now, too. Bunky, uh, uh, unsure what the play is here. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what you do. Right, here come the Vils building the third TC at the same time. Sitting some eagles over here on this gold. Fresh having a heck of a game. Heck of a game. I'm not sure what Bunky does here. Uh, going for the rewall. Got the knights around now. Wonder, will anyone think a switch? Could Bunky be thinking switch into the infantry line or... Oh, you're not going to want to... Don't trickle the knights in. Yep, yeah, okay. Hit and go, hit and go. Use that mobility to your advantage. Watchtower. Okay, be tough to defend the whole the whole base with towers, but oh, and fresh saying it's time with this big ball of eagles. This is uh, he, fresh is just saying this is America, and we love our eagles. They ain't bald, but they're eagles nonetheless. Uh, he's he's ready to go. He's ready to go, and this eagle. Oh, there, yeah, nothing. Bunky can do. Is he gonna? Does he see the castle drop? He'll have to see it. No, it's just outside. Oh no. Oh no, it's just outside the vision. He'll see it when it pops up. Oh my god, that couldn't be more perfectly placed from fresh. Just outside the vision. Alright, let's see this pop up from Bunky's perspective. We got the percentage down here. Oh man. Right on top of the gold. There's no other safe gold for him. And. Three, 
two, one, and go. One, two, three, oh, four, five. Understandable, understandable call there from Bunky right as that castle came up. Like, yup, that's the game. Uh, well done, Fresh. Uh, and well done, Bunky, as well. But Fresh did, had a heck of a game there. Let's take a jump into the statistics. Oh, and do we have the players joining in? I see Fresh joining the party. Timeline. Man, uh, Feudal Age onwards. Fresh did a good job. Let's take a look at Military and KD and Fresh's favor with the cheaper units, too. That Army High, great. And Economy. Whew. Fresh, the master of economy. Uh, got up to castle. Similar times here. Um, got the castle. And then the APM. Pretty similar. Ooh, we got a jump here when Fresh was doing some intense micro. And then Bunky's intense micro. Fight going on here at nine minutes. Nicely done. All right, are you guys uh, in the party? I am here. What a game. I... What a BS full random. <laughs> <laughs> Against uh, the Saracens, who are a yeah. camel specialty sim yeah, and archers, yeah. which, uh. Yeah. yeah. It's definitely my favorite. First time I've ever won with Inkins, but it's definitely my favorite sim. Uh, as soon as I saw you got Inkins, I was like, ah, oh, this is no go. <laughs> yeah, smart move going full Eagles on it, fresh. Like, that was yeah. what I said. Just go for that. Um, I, I, did, I didn't. I, I didn't even realize I overchopped in the back, and then I was like, "Oh, yeah, I did the same thing." And I oh, when he got in the first time, up. yeah, that wasn't an overchop. There's a gap between your mill and the house to the north. Oh, that I God, I still hate yeah. This. <laughs> the hills oh, yeah. make it so tough. There's a one uh, tile gap. Come on. He looked walled up. I ran past him yep. like screw. It. I just clicked inside your base, and they ran right through. I was like, oh, uh, yeah, oh. yep. Uh, yeah, that did a that did a bunch of damage. You had the the counter raid with the knights on his wood line was juicy though. That was good. I had a gap there in my house and wood line too. Yep. Uh, good job on the eagle just, production. Yeah, he had way too many eagles for me to be able to handle. Yeah. Oh my god. The the only thing I thought is that you, you I didn't know, but Saracens do have fully upgraded champions, so you could have done that, oh, but you'd have had. You'd have had to done that from the outset, and then he yeah. has the easy option of switching into arbs, and then you're yeah. kind of screwed then too. So, uh, yeah, I was like tough one. And the the uh, GG right as that castle popped up too was like <laughs> perfect. I was like, I see this castle I, being built right outside of his vision. <laughs> Let's see what happens. I couldn't see it, and literally, like, I saw all the eagles he had, and as soon as that castle popped, I was like, yep, we're done. Yeah, <laughs> understandable. I literally had it from your perspective with the countdown of the castle up, and was like, let's see what happens. Three, two, one, and then Bill kill, Bill kill, Bill kill, GG. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, that was uh, well, well played, fresh. Nicely done. Yeah, definitely that, uh, had the... Uh... A preemptive tower on your gold definitely threw me for a little looper. Yep. Uh, that's the first... That's something I've always been playing out of games since the first time I've actually done it. I'm always susceptible to those rushes gold line. Yep. yep. That, uh... And being on top of a hill helped. Right there. I was so mad about that hill between my stone and wood line. <laughs> Couldn't put a TC there. Oh, oh yeah, shit! Yeah, that would have been a nice yeah. spot right there. That's a painful. My micro with my scouts though just ruined my home eco. Yeah, you did end up with a lot of idle time while you were going forward with those. Oh yeah, I was like, oh, I didn't yep. have much hope for this game as soon as I saw the matchup. So yeah, I figured I gotta go. Have it up. I was definitely in the like thirty minutes <laughs> at least. Yeah. It was an eventful game. I liked that at least. Mike, what's do you have any thoughts to add in from your uh, I, perspective? No, I I thought it was really well played. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed actually watching people play age that knew what they were doing compared to what I normally did. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I mean I, it's it's a good thing you use the caveat comparatively because we do not know what we're doing. <laughs> 
I was like Saracens. I was like, I don't know. Like, I was like, go Knights and then get a castle and go Mamluk. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But yeah, that's even an issue too with uh, Saracens. Like, that's an anti-cavalry unit. Yeah, I had nothing. Like, I had nothing to be like. Oh yeah, let me uh, take on this. How many eagles do you have? At this moment, it was. 29 with another in production yeah, no, absolutely the, no way. yeah the highest army was 31 yeah, absolutely no way I actually started I, I don't think it would have showed up in capture because I think I can't but I was building my cast leash or my heal age building so I cast leash I started to drop an archery range so I'm like what am I doing he has nuts out uh, I did, so you I did at one point see your archery range and I was like He's trying to mess with me. <laughs> I ended up deleting it after before it got pushed. I was like, oh, oh I d God. yeah, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> I was getting ready to switch over to like light cav, and then just try to meet try your to numbers. Oh uh, yeah. And then the castle dropped, and I was like, nah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was a perfect castle placement, like on a hill over your gold, <laughs> right? Yeah. Right I was near about to ask about the placement because I didn't really think much about it. I'm like, I just want to get this up as quick yep. as possible before I get dropped. No, so that, that was... I, uh, I yeah. was nowhere near dropping you. <laughs> on, on, yeah, on the gold was perfect. Exactly what you needed. And it even ranged to one of the... It ranged the stable, so production out of the stable would be tough. So, yeah. GG, man. Good game. I, was, I still have a little bit of uh, anxiety and nerves from that. I don't know why I get so worked up on... <laughs> All right, so I'm going to pull up the age bracket here. Do I have it? All right, so Fresh moved on from Annie. Put the... Paste the line there. Move the wrong one. And then we have Fresh beating Bungie. So Fresh moves on. Oh, I didn't update this either. Fresh faces Stone Roll for, and the winner of that match faces a limited juice. Wait, does that mean I gotta fight Mike in relegations? <laughs> uh, if if we want, if we want to do relegations, uh, we definitely could. If Mike's on is board, it, is it me that. or is it Annie? Uh, fresh here. Uh, I think Annie. I think Annie played her game and. Uh, yeah, she beat Mike. Yeah, step step back. Lost. Yeah, she stepped back from that. Although, yeah, we could yeah. we could try to get another Annie in. if Annie wants to play against you. Get a um, yeah relegation side bracket going. Yeah, I had so many like early mistakes. I think I lost two to elephants trying to get his. Oh answer. yeah, yeah. The timing of that with the. Uh, yeah. Yeah, oh, James coming by. So. Yeah, you lost that eagle, but Tom lost a a vill oh, to like, it. At least one, and like, maybe two. Yeah. I came over to time to see my eagle go down, but it like went dark. I'm like, did his village go down? I couldn't yeah. Tell. Yeah. I so took you sheep. you also unintentionally <laughs> douched my elephant. Like yeah. I shot it and you ran in front, so the elephant stopped. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed that as well. Like you had to come back and hit it again. That That's caused funny. some of the issue then, because then you like seeing the eagle and moving. Around. Yeah, that was unfortunate timing. That sheep grab definitely threw me off my fuel. I spent <laughs> so much idle time trying to get that. <laughs> Don't worry, I spent a lot of idle time doing that. Yeah, <laughs> it was worth it. <laughs> yeah, that, oh, was, that good. was good. I was gonna send them off in all four different directions, but <laughs> I was like, this is too much fun. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to stop the recording here, uh, but looking forward to Fresh versus Stone Roll. Yeah, good game.